Hello and welcome to another video by Haste Computer Repair. And today we're taking a look at this great budget gaming PC I put together for use in 2024. Now this just happens to be my last deep cool case before they got banned from selling items in North America. In particular, it's the CC560 PC case with four pre-installed ARGB fans, three for air intake and one for exhaust. And I also have the CPU fan synced up with the tower case color cycles. Speaking of which, that is a Thermalrite Assassin 120X ARGB CPU cooler. And there is a Intel Core i5-12400F CPU with 6 cores and 12 threads. Beside that, there is 16 gigabytes of Corsair Vengeance DDR4 3600MHz RAM. I should note that speeds will cap at 3200MHz with this particular Intel 12th generation CPU. It would take a particular motherboard and some overclocking skills to reach the 3600MHz as advertised. And here we have a Dell OEM RTX 3060 Ti graphics card with 8GB of GDDR6 memory. For storage, we have a T Team Group 512GB MP33 NVMe solid state drive with Windows 11 Pro installed. In addition to that, I put in a 1TB 2.5 inch Toshiba hard drive for extra storage. And this is all packed onto an MSI Pro H610M G DDR4 motherboard. And just beneath this power supply shroud, you can see that we have a Corsair RM 650X 650 watt modular power supply. On the top IO of the PC case, we have a power button, one times USB 3.0 microphone and headphone combo jack usb 2.0 and this button right here controls the argb fans and you can press it and as you can see you can shift through different color schemes onto the rear io of the motherboard we have an hdmi port vga port and display port that can be used with this particular cpu because there are no integrated graphics there's four times usb 2.0 mouse and keyboard ps2 port two times usb 3.2 rj45 ethernet port audio in and out, and the 3060 Ti graphics card has 1x HDMI 2.1 and 3x DisplayPort 1.4a. Overall, I really like how this PC turned out. I think it looks really good. I like building into a lot of deep cool cases and it's kind of a shame that that's probably not going to happen anymore. If you happen to be using the same hardware in 2024, please let me know in the comments and I'd love to talk about it there. It's probably time for me to stop talking and let my cat sleep in peace. So let's check out the gaming and benchmark performance.